there and welcome to a new series on my channel called the autumn tutorials you're probably wondering what this even is so um basically it's a series where i just review youtube videos that i really like that i can't comment on because the the user he disabled the comments in the video now i'm gonna start with a very simple video it's uh, Noah's food review monster energy drink by call me angel now Noah He's one of my favorite youtubers no matter how much hate he gets and I don't really think he gets that much hate uh, He He's reviewing a monster energy drink and he disabled the comments I guess because he didn't like the jokes even though in all his other videos he leaves he lets people comment so Let's go and welcome back to another episode of Noah's feed review Noah's feed review Okay. Also, does anyone else notice that from his earlier videos compared to his newer videos nowadays, his voice changed? I guess it's just because of more weight gain because he says that he doesn't care. He just eats whatever he wants to eat because he should be allowed to and he says, you know, who cares? Want proof? Well, listen to one of his earlier videos compared to his older videos. I've seen my refrigerator for like two days and it's like witty, witty cold. We also have a Hershey's milk chocolate bar. So before when he used to talk, he couldn't pronounce his R's and L's and just pronounce W's instead. But nowadays when he talks, he spits his S's. Quite a big change there. Let's just continue the review, shall we? So I've had this in my refrigerator for like two days and it's like witty witty cold. Like my hands are freezing right now. I have like hypothermia, man. Like, in all honesty, to God, I highly doubt that someone would get hypothermia just from touching a really cold drink that's been in your refrigerator for two days. It's, sure, it could be cold, but when give you hypothermia, man? Like, where does this kid even get his facts from? Like, what? Today we'll be reviewing Monster Energy Zero Ultra. Also, another thing, he says that he's gonna review Monster Energy Zero Ultra. When he literally has two of them on his dresser in the background. Like, he could have drank one of those. He, he didn't have to get an extra third one. Like, what? Also, another thing, before the comments were disabled in that video, I literally saw someone comment that, even though I already knew about that. I guess he just wanted to spread the word. Yeah. So, on the back here, it said it has zero calories. So, whenever your mom or whatever said, why are you drinking that? It's bad for you. You say, well, mom, look. Zero calories. It's good for me. Dude, just because it has zero calories does not mean it's good for you. And I'm pretty sure your mom won't fall for that one either. Sure, zero calories is healthier than a couple of calories. But still, he gave us a 10 out of a 10. Which means it must have had some sugar in it, right? You love sugar. I love sugar. And even with no... No calories. Diet Mountain Dew tastes just as well as normal Mountain Dew. So I would give Monster Zero Energy, or Energy Zero Ultra, uh, get a 10 out of a 10. See? Man, I just love the sound effects that happen in his videos. Even though it's not his fault, I could never unwrap the wrapper or opens a can. I don't know why. It just sounds weird whenever it's in his videos. So, when I open it, it feels like a Sprite or something. Now, I have not had to have that drink before. I will someday, but I'm pretty sure what an energy drink would not be anything like a Sprite. He says it feels like a Sprite, not it tastes like a Sprite. So, I, I guess I could understand that. And I'll see you next episode when I eat some more food. So bye bye. Man, what a perfect ending to his video. I love that. Either way, that's going to be it for the Autumn Tutorials episode 1. See you in episode 2. And uh, yeah, subscribe. <laughs>